<laughs> uh, I'm Sasha Wise. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to do a poem now. I'm going to do a poem later. Nice to see some familiar faces in the audience. Hi, Dean. This is my friend Melissa, my family. Hi. Anyway. So um, basically, this poem I'm going to do, um, yeah, so basically I've got like a degree in like science, and this poem is like me putting my degree to use finally. So I use it in poetry, a bit random, but whatever, it is what it is. Um, it's called Science of Digestion. So you're going to have a bit of a biology lesson now. When I study us, I see you inside out. Your esophagus is the narrow opening to our first dinner date. I think you were hungry for something, because I sat there, swallowing emotion, but thinking it was fate, the way you traveled slow, in your Fiat Panto to my stomach. Along those bumpy roads by peristalsis, there we churned all day within your muscular walls and we mixed saliva and acid until it burned. And I was feeling it. The way you were twirling inorganic matter within close confinement, but then you had to go and increase surface area available for absorption through finger structures of villi? Hmm. You said you wanted to spurt chyme into my small intestine. But my sphincter would only open a little <laughs> because you were too large. <laughs> but not to worry, because your salty bowel broke up all this fat with aerobic, anaerobic, doing the split type exercise. We stayed in there for hours, producing more enzymes. She can trigger off more hormones and neutralize me for a moment after moment and moment until I couldn't take it anymore. But I had not yet digested fully, so I was patient. Well, I let you take out all of this water from me with your large intestine. You got me at the point of no return. When my legs no longer work, my face is making faces like it hurts until finally, finally, finally. I release. And now that is the shit. Thanks, guys. <laughs>